The world's most common habit, dating all the way back to ancient times, is chewing gum. Every year, people chomp over 100,000 tons of chewing gum, and one of the most popular places to chew gum is in public schools. So with the constant chomping of chewing gum during school, is it really good for you? Or just plain disgusting? Gum is a harm to school because kids that chew are immature and it ends up in places that they shouldn't put it, like under a classroom desk, and they're violating school property. The inappropriate disposal of chewing gum can carry forms of different diseases and bacteria. A fresh piece of gum could carry mono or strep. Gum also has been banned for a number of other reasons in more than just schools. Theme parks such as Disney, Universal Studios, SeaWorld, and many more have banned the selling of chewing gum to help keep the park grounds cleaner. Not only was chewing gum banned in theme parks, the Singapore government outlawed chewing gum in 1992. Chewing gum was becoming an actual danger when found wedged in sliding doors of underground trains. What about schools? Should gum be banned or should students be allowed to chew it? Chewing gum, a couple of different effects. One, it has mint and the mint chemical is known, and there is research to back this up, that it calms your stomach. Also, a kinesthetic learner, who is a learner that likes motion, um, would find some comfort in the chewing motion, and it, there is some research that proves it increases the blood flow to the brain with the chewing action, which of course would be good for retrieving cognitive memories. Chewing gum in school is a bad idea, particularly in the performing arts areas because it is bad for the instruments, it's distracting to the performers while they're performing, and it's very unprofessional and unbecoming when they are performing in front of an audience while chewing gum. Um, it takes away from the overall professional etiquette of the performer. Mr. Dan Hogan, a custodian at Fraser Public Schools, shows how much time and money goes into the process of removing gum to help prevent sickness in schools. It's hard to put a time on it. We wash the tables, we flip them over, we scrape the gum off of them. So it is part of our summer cleanup for sure. We buy chemicals to remove gum from certain locations and we spend hours in the summer cleaning it off tables. So with all the hard work that goes into cleaning gum in schools, is it really worth having students allowed to chew it? Gum is good for school because when I study for a test, I chew a certain flavor gum, and then when I go in to take the test, I chew the same flavor gum and it helps me recall the information. I personally think it's helpful. Uh, my students find I always have a mint or a piece of chewing gum before every class. The only drawback would be students putting their gum underneath the tables when they're done instead of throwing it in the trash. But I think overall with high school students who have a maturity level, I really find it very helpful.